There was a lot of research that was done in the 50s and 60s and into the 70s with wolves in the wild. And the whole development of the field of ethology, where people were going out and living with wolves and studying animals in the wild, studying the wolves in the wild, and learning about pack structure and all the body language signals of dominance and, sum and submission. And then they sort of, people sort of took this idea of, well, dogs are descended from wolves. Um, they are closely, most closely related evolutionarily to, to wolves. And that means they must be just like, their behavior must be just like wolves. It was sort of an overextension or an overgeneralization of fascinating information that we had learned about wolves uh, some decades ago, and it's just stuck around forever.